Hello, today's daily reading comes from the book of Amos, chapter 9. It's always said that prior to reading, get to a church that has Bible study or Sunday school where the word can be broken down and shared for an easy understanding. Also, get, get you a Bible that you can read. There are numerous versions from King James and NIV. Get you some friends that you can break bread with and have church with one another. But most importantly, and above all the things I've said, call upon the Lord. If you knock at his door, he will answer and fill you up with his wisdom if that is what you truly seek. Amen. Amos chapter 9 reads as follows. I saw the Lord standing by the altar and he said, Strike the tops of the pillars so that the thresholds shake. <coughs> Excuse me. Bring them down on the heads of all the people. Those who are left I will kill with the sword. Not one will get away. None will escape. Though they dig down to the depths below, from there my hand will take them. Though they climb up to the heavens above, from there I will bring them down. Though they hide themselves on top of Carmel, there I will hunt them down and seize them. Though they hide from my eyes at the bottom of the sea, there I will command the serpent to bite them. Though they are driven into exile by their enemies, there I will command the sword to slay them. I will keep my eye on them for harm and not for good. The Lord, the Lord Almighty, he touches the earth and it melts. And all who live in it mourn. The whole land rises like the Nile, then sinks like the river of Egypt. He builds his lofty palace in the heavens and sets his foundation on the earth. He calls for the waters of the sea and pours them out over the face of the land. The Lord is his name. Are you? Are not you Israelites the same to me as the Cushites, declares the Lord? Did I not bring Israel up from Egypt, the Philistines from Kaphtor? And the Arians from Kerr, surely the eyes of the sovereign Lord are on the sinful kingdom. I will destroy it from the face of the earth. Yet I will not totally destroy the descendants of Jacob, declares the Lord. For I will give the command and I will shake the people of Israel among all the nations. As grain is shaken in the sieve, sleeve, I'm sorry, and not a pebble will reach the ground. All the sinners among my people will die by the sword. All those who say disaster will not overtake or meet us. In that day, I will restore David's fallen shelter. I will repair its broken walls and restore its ruins and will rebuild it as I used to be so that they may possess the remnant of Edom. And all the nations that bear my name, declares the Lord, who will do these things. The days are coming, declares the Lord, when the reaper will be overtaken by the plowman and the planter by the one treading grapes. New wine will drip from the mountains and flow from all the hills, and I will bring my people Israel back from exile. They will rebuild the ruined cities and live in them. They will plant vineyard and drink their wine. They will make gardens and eat their fruit. I will plant Israel in their own land, never again to be uprooted for the land I have given them, says the Lord your God. Amos has been completed. Amen.